Hey guys, it's Clyde here. Today I purchased 25 of the premium German containers, which is not typically something I would do, but I'm sitting here chatting with Scott and he did it and it worked out for him. So watch me not get the same great stuff he got dropped. Scott, how you doing this morning? Pretty good, sunk cost fallacy, keep Woo! going. Yep, exactly. Well, I've already whaled this far. Let's just go and a little further. <laughs> uh, all right, so we're gonna open these boxes and just see what we get. This is pretty uh, This is pretty low value entertainment, but, uh, but it should be fun. So 25 of these premium boxes, I bought them. They're on sale right now. Um, I used dubs that I bought with a coupon earlier, so they're kind of double on sale. Um, so I'm in, uh, hopefully, in pretty good shape for this investment. We'll see what we come out of it with. So box number one. Paint, not surprised. So German paint um, is going to be probably a pretty common drop here. It was with Scottish drops as well. Yeah, out of the 25 I bought, um, I don't think paint was half of them, but it was a fair number. Mm -hmm. That's <laughs> two in a row. <laughs> two in a row for me. I know they roll these when they're created, right? But I always used to say, like, you know, if you like what you're getting in, in boxes, keep opening them. If you stop liking it, go play a match and come back, because I think it's different, but I don't think that's how it actually works. There's that's only one way that I... There's only one way I know of that'll change what has rolled, and that's if you if it preordains that you get one of the ships and you don't have that ship, and then before you open the crate, you get that ship, it will re-roll that when you go to open it mm, yeah right some signals some paint here low odds of getting well, i don't know it's always low odds i'm gonna, right? I'm gonna feel really bad after we talked about this then i got <laughs> two boats and you don't get any boats then you're Dude. just gonna be kicking rocks all weekend no man th that happens to me all the time now for me i play this game a lot you know this you play this game a lot i like getting these signals right i'll get good use out of these oh things. yeah yeah those signals no are problem. great no problem at all getting those but to be fair if i oh hey there we go a little coal not a lot nice. but a little um, you know, again, I bought these, they're 25% off and it's the only price they'll ever be advertised at. Okay, uh, whatever. Yeah. You know, the, the dubs were already 30% off. So like I can justify it in my stupid brain now. Getting, way. getting the dubs on sale. And that's, that's the same thing that I did. That's the magic um, to this thing. right? But when you said that the, these are on sale now, I just like to rephrase that to that. They are for sale now. Yeah. <laughs> they, <they're... laughs> yeah. That is the, that is the available purchase price. Uh, it's what you're going to get them for. So signals and paint guys, that's that's all we've gotten so far. Good signals. You got coal. Oh, and some coal. Wait a minute. That's the sound. Perfect. We got the Maxwell Immelman. <laughs> you got the tier 10. I knew, I knew you'd probably, if you got any of them, because you want Brandenburg, I assumed yeah, you were going to yeah. get Immelman. I'll get stuck with uh, Immelman and Weimar, so which are, are, I'm Immelman's happy about awesome this. Ship. I'm happy about this. Immelman, that's wonderful. A tier 10, uh, I won't say for free, because we know that's BS, but we'll say uh, out of a container. Um, well, 14 to go. Let's see what's next. We like what we like. Keep or like what we're getting. Keep clicking. No music. We talked about the music with the. Uh, the the music's the thing that really makes the heart race. And the I cool know. thing with that Emelman is it comes with a super container. Oh, that's true. If I play For, it uh, soon. Two more weeks. You, can, yeah. you just got to get a match in, in it. Which we'll do. Signals again. No music. And you hear that. I love the way they do that, even though I hate these guys for. <laughs> <laughs> for giving us the gamble boxes but that box rises up and before it opens it goes boo -doo, boo -doo, boo -boo, or whatever the song is mm -hmm. and you're like excitement and you have to still wait yep. to see what you're gonna get they know what they're doing it is an audible drug oh, free xp hey, i only got one of those and i, I would have like been happy getting too. more than one that's a good box i am a yeah 100 percent. i am a serial captain grinder i love having max point captains and i, I know that's probably a pretty obvious statement for most people to make but you, I've got an entire spreadsheet built for this, so that's a great drop. That actually means I can make my Des Moines and secondary USBB captain 21 points now, because I was about 70. 10 to go, counting this one. Siggies. Siggies are good. Uh, yeah, I was, it would be wonderful to see a Brandenburg pop out, but uh, that's okay if it doesn't. I'll have to be comfortable with my Immelman, which I'm, I am happy about. Now I need to be yeah, the carriers. The ship table on these boxes is Brandenburg, Weimar, Maximilman, yeah. or the tier eight tech tree, uh, Gustav Julius Markar. 
which I like good job marker, but if you bought 25 of these and all you got was a tier 8 tech tree boat, it would be a bummer. <laughs> oh, you so, got straight normal free XP. That's that's a okay drop. I would have liked that number to be a little bigger, but... I'll yeah, I didn't get any of those. I didn't know that was on the table. Yeah, I'm looking forward to when they have those numbers. Oh. Perfect. Vimer. 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 Very cool. Okay. I got five more chances to get the boat I was looking for. You pre <laughs> predicted it. I already have the the Gustav Julius, uh, the marker. Yep. So like, uh, as, as Scott was just talking, that boat's not going to be available for me because they'll re-roll if they picked that. It will re-roll. It so, should re-roll to a different boat. Is that how that's, that works? I don't know. If, that's how that, it works how on works? super containers or it works on sand. That would be nice if that were the case. It should re-roll to a different boat. It shouldn't oh, re-roll okay. to paint. Yeah, now, if you have all the boats, which that is nine, how super container. nine containers into the 25, I had all the boats. And yeah. I then I got a lot more paint, and I feel like it was just dumping paint on me, going, here's some <laughs> crappy paint. Like this Nickelodeon, you get. you're getting slimed. Yeah, right? it was. Yeah. It was. Oh, good. It wouldn't be so bad if that paint had three stats or if it sold for more silver. Oh, hey. Okay. That's good. I'm, you know what? At this point, guys, I cannot be disappointed with my drops. Uh, two boxes to go, despite the fact that I was hoping for, uh, hoping for a uh, random bird. Okay, one more chance. This is it for all the marbles. How much paint are they gonna give me? Twenty-one. It's gonna be twenty-one. <laughs> it's gonna be twenty-one points paints, isn't it? Oh, ah, Siggies. We'll take these ones, basilisks. Well, that's so you it, got, guys. You got two ships. Yeah. yeah pretty good. Well, we can click on the, the informational button here and go to notifications. Signals, camo, signals, signals. Uh, ship edition. That's the stuff. So we got Vimer. Let's take a look at those guys since we got them sitting right here. Yeah, I also got Weimar this morning and hadn't hadn't really looked at it. I was kind of skeptical about the boat when it was in t it was in test for a really long time before it was released, and basically it went from being super overpowered to really so good much. at doing. I think it's really good at doing operations. It it doesn't have great range, but I understand it's pretty fun to play. Um, it's a it's a York yeah, fourteen click it's, range. Yikes. Yeah, it's it's a York hull with. <laughs> the guns off of what uh nurnberg so york has 210 mil guns four turrets two barrels a piece and if we look at weimar it's 150 so smaller but you get 12 barrels four turrets three guns a piece yeah this is a, a tier seven mains or mines is basically yeah, they, what it is they, it just doesn't have the range it in test it had really good reload and, and range and it was really powerful and they just kind of kept cranking it back and holding it and cranking it back and holding it until it was released and so when it came out i didn't jump on it um no, it's a lot of people nice... say that it's really good for like narai like if you're into farming mm. operations for silver i guess sure. this boat's like a god king at that it's got a nice spotter, so it's a slightly premium spotter that goes 30% instead of 20% of your range, but the reload time's 240, which is pretty standard. Mm -hmm. um, I think you could probably do some, you know, I'll have to play around with builds on this. I'm not gonna do it live on this, but um, I think you could probably do some good stuff there. The uh, acoustics are solid, 3.8 for torpedoes, 5.5 five for ships. You can swap that for a defensive AA consumable. Obviously up here with the little green star, we know we could put on a premium defensive AA engine boost uh, we can't do engine boost oh we can do engine boost it's got an engine boost yeah it's um, pretty neat and it's not and normal on german boats no no so that's kind of unique for weimar that's a or weimar however you want to pronounce it it's a pretty good uh i think it's going to be interesting to try 14 kilometer range is a little anemic on that but i like the shell velocity at 960 and that german quarter pen 38 millimeters of he penetration capacity eight percent fire chance with that fire rate I think you're going to use islands and things to, to dart in and out of stuff. I don't know. We'll play with it a little bit here. We'll take it out on stream soon. Yeah, I'll have to try mine out probably on the, on stream soon as well. I don't know if yeah. we'll do it at the same time, but... Yeah, um, maybe, maybe not. <laughs> I, I have I also have Munchen, which is like another Tier 7 German light cruiser that they put in mm. the game with little rat -a tat tat guns. And it has less barrels than this, but more reload and better innate range. And so that's why I've kind of steered away from this one. But... Uh, I didn't have it in my port, and so I'm stoked to get it out of a crate and add it to my port. That was that was definitely my reaction. I I wasn't racing to the checkout line to buy a Weimer, but uh, when it landed in the port for the container, I was like, okay, you know, why not? So it's got two versions of the camo. This is the second, uh, the alt alternate option, the gray one. This one's a little bit brighter. I think I like the gray one a little bit better, so I think that's what I'll run. 
um, and it does life. it does have <laughs> this which is a really cool yeah. looking camo you can buy it for about that's a cool camo that's I wouldn't buy it but I'm not gonna a cool buy it camo. <laughs> but I think it's really cool yeah I'm not gonna buy it unless somehow I fall in love with the Vimer and I just I don't know that I think that's gonna happen uh, but we'll give it a try we'll take it out. I bet you it's fun you got too many boats to play in this game anyway looking at the Immelman We'll jump over here. I've got Helmut Zimmer as the captain. Well, he's fired because I already have a German carrier captain. <laughs> but uh, but uh, I think my German carrier captain's either a Dasha or like a guy with a sweet mustache. I can't remember. Um, so here we go. I like him. I got like paint. I think it looks cool. Now, it's got airplanes. It's got the uh, skip bombers, uh, which are now a little bit more common in the game than when Immelman came out. Um, torpedoes and then... Uh, and that's it. That's it, huh? Wow, yep, I, no I was looking planes. for a third one, yeah. But yeah. I actually like both of these armaments. Yeah, um, they're great. Um, and if it just gives you more of those. I don't know, what's your experience with Immelman? I, I've had good matches in it, even in randoms, where I'm not obviously a CV player, or I've been trying to learn CVs, but I've had good matches in it. I really like the skip bombs in it. It's a fun mechanic. Yeah. I'm glad I had this boat before the Russians came out, because it's made me better with those. Oh, it's um, green on the side, too. That's kind of cool. The, um, it only it doesn't loose as many skip bombs as the Russians, of course. Like the now the Russians, their bombs have more hops at higher tiers, and there's like more of them. Right, they always um, come out but you last. Can, so but you can do multiple out. drops with this, obviously, because it's not Russian. And so the other cool thing about uh, Immelman uh, is its planes are really fast. Um, the speed on the planes is great. Yeah, I've uh, I've noted that on a lot of the German. Uh, carriers but we got 194 knots and this is before any modification this is vanilla with an untrained captain 194 knots on the torpedo bombers and 214 on the skip bombers you'll be able to modify that through captain perks etc um and maybe upgrades i can't remember uh, but we'll, we'll see how quick we can get those i bet you 230 240 is probably not going to be hard to do uh, with with engine boost up that they go in the mid twos they move yeah i was gonna say with, with squadron the... size is good and the plane reload is pretty good especially with the skip bombers because you can drop outside of you know uh, outside of mid-range aa a lot of times and if you know what you're doing then you can break off before you get your planes chewed up so it's fun it's a neat yeah. boat and it's got it doesn't the, uh... have like crazy secondaries uh like like draft zeppelin or anything like that i was kind of hoping it would have that as well but it it doesn't 6.9 kilometers again unmodified i don't know what you i don't think you can do much with your captain to do that you can there are there's secondary, are there secondary? skills oh, for, right on there. the Close cv course. branch yeah yeah yeah, yeah. So you've at least got that so another 20 percent to 6.9 that's another 1.4 almost yeah um, i wouldn't build into it but it's no, there but you could right yeah. i think um, i have one german captain that has that silly cv uh build for zeppelin that yeah. i maybe have used yeah. on this before where it's less about the planes and more about the boat being you know secondary being, monster uh, being a problem up close i mean obviously yeah, yeah you're going to try to use your planes as your main arm i mean i think with this one but i'll have to get it out there and give her a shot see how she goes but uh cool i'm very pleased with the drops uh, again looking for a brandenburg which means you get everything else uh and so <laughs> perfectly happy i think with that and then yeah we'll find a way to put those signals to use we'll level up some ships with those but well, cool, guys. Uh, thanks for uh, giving this a watch. And Scotta, thanks for being a part of the show today. Appreciate it, man. Yeah, no worries, buddy. All righty. Well, we'll catch you guys in another video. Come see us on stream, twitch.tv slash Clyde Plays Live. Or just hang out here on YouTube if that's your thing. We'll go to come on over to youtube.com slash C as in channel slash Clyde Plays. All right, guys, take it easy and have a fantastic day.